What's going on guys, Big D here, and today we will be taking a look at three of these Pokemon Sword and Shield Mini Tins. I don't know what packs come inside of them, I know there's five different ones that we could have gotten, but I could only find these three. Uh, I know two car packs of cards come inside of each, but maybe we'll find the other ones later. Collect all five of the art cards that are in these and maybe i'll throw them into a video if i can find them at some point but let's uh just start this off with this sopple case here it's a uh, kind of a cool looking case kind of like um a forest type vibe uh, maybe a barn back there abandoned building whatever it is i mean it's pretty cool art on it I have no idea what set comes in this. I'm guessing it's just the base set. It's probably not Rebel Clash or anything like that. Okay. Okay. Alright, and comes with this little Garchomp coin here. Pretty cool. I mean, for a cheap plastic coin. Pretty cool, I guess. Okay. And inside of the tin, it does come with sun and moon base sets there we go. Mm -hmm. oh and it comes with a evolutions pack Should try that out oh okay it's not even a pokemon card it's a literal just art card of the uh tin artwork has all of sobble's information on there when scared, it's po this Pokemon cries, it tears pack the chemical punch of 100 onions, and attackers won't be able to resist weeping. Collect all five. Like I said, there are five of them. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. It kind of shows, like, that's the color of what that is, and the rest make the sort of a picture that's on there. That's actually kind of cool. Not a Pokemon card. I don't know how collectible that really is, but uh, it's, that's pretty cool. Okay, um, well, we have the Sun and Moon Evolutions, or Sun and Moon Base Set and the Evolutions Pack from uh, X and Y. Don't know why they threw that in there. I'm guessing it's just they have a shit ton of extras and they just want to get rid of them. So uh, let's, let's start with the Evolutions Pack. Never have good luck with the Evolutions packs. I don't think I've ever pulled anything good out of it. Oh, is it this way? It is this way. There is the code card. One, two, three to the front. I forget if there is an energy on the back. I don't believe there is. But starting off, we have a Poliwhirl. We have... Maintenance? Yeah, Maintenance. Okay. Haunter. Growlithe. Machop, Voltorb, Diglett. I really do like how they brought back like the old art styles, the old backgrounds. I really do like that. It's a big nostalgia thing, but just the set in itself, there wasn't enough incentive to actually buy more packs. We have a Caterpie. We have a Reverse Minorino. And on the very end, we have a regular Arcanine. Okay. There's that. Now let's jump on to Sword and Shield. Base set. See if we can pull anything good out of here. Alright, there is the code card for you guys. One, two, three to the front, getting rid of the fire energy. We have Hitmonlee. That's actually a pretty cool card. There's a Hitmonchan back there. Um, if we pull a Hitmonchan, I'm hoping to see a Hitmonlee back there. That'd be pretty cool. I like when they put the actual, like, other Pokemon in there, and then there's other cards in either this set or the other set where it shows that Pokemon in the background. It's a different view. It's, it's pretty cool, in my opinion. We have Solazzle. Again, a really cool art. Really cool art on that pet, right, on that card. Metal Saucer. We have Galarian Ponyta. 
Sobble out of the Sobble tin that we just grabbed. Marcatus? Marcatus? I don't know. I'm still not great at pronouncing these uh, new generation's Pokemon names. We have a Mudbray. Boneyard. Team Yell Grunt as a reverse. And on the very end, we have a regular Morapiku. Okay. Again, not uh, not doing too great so far. All right, let's uh, go with the score bunny. Oh, that one opened up well. Okay. So we have the another Garchomp coin here. Whatever, that's great. We have another Sword and Shield base set, and another Evolutions pack with the Sobble, or the uh, Score Bunny art card. A warming of a warm up of running around it gets fire energy coursing through its Pokemon's body. Once that happens, it's ready to fight at full power, and it looks like it actually goes. Right next to the Sobble. Yeah, see, it's, it's making a picture back there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's kind of a cool touch with it. Let's throw these out of the way. Okay, let's, uh, let's start with the evolutions again. Okay, we are starting out with an energy over here. There is the code card. Go one, two, three to the front, and we start off with a super potion. We have chameleon or charmeleon, <laughs> Venusaur Spirit Link. We have a fighting energy, Star You, Tangla, Rattata, Weedle. We have a reverse Kakuna. And on the very end, we have another common Raticate. Well, not common, but you get what I mean. It's it's worthless. Okay. All right, Sword and Shield. And guys, I know I can barely speak, especially today. But that's just so you just just so you know, in the area that I am in, it is hot as balls. Okay, so I'll uh, just just bear with me. There's the code card. One, two, three to the front, getting rid of the grass energy. We have Pokey Kid. That's actually kind of cool. Eat more. Galarian Stunfisk. Sinistee. Wooloo, Shelder, Krogunk, and that's actually a really cool art of Krogunk. I don't think I've seen that through the set yet. Silly Cobra. He's a interesting, interesting choice of a Pokemon. We have a Reverse Rillaboom at the end here. It's actually a, kind of a cool art. That's actually really cool. Just him banging his drum like he's beating his meat. And on the very end... Ooh! I did not know this was on this set, but that's... That's kind of cool! We have a Tapu Koko V card. Yeah, that's a cool card. I mean, I remember they put ta all the Tapus in, like, obviously the Sun and Moon sets, but the... This... That's, that's a cool one. That's much cooler than what they did originally. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, we are on to the last tin, this Galarian Ponyta here. Had decent luck with that last one, that last pack. Mm -hmm. That's great. Uh, hopefully we can uh, pull something a little bit better. Or just as good, like, I'd be happy with that. 
Oh, come on. You know, I've said it a million times, and I'll say it again. Don't bite your fucking nails, kids. I don't know, what do I have to say? It'll, it'll help your colon or something. Don't bite your nails. You don't want to struggle open up, opening up kids' uh, Pokemon cards like me. Okay. Open this up. Jeez, how many... Like, is that, is this the only coin that they put in this, in, in these tins? Now I have three worthless Garchomp coins. Great. Okay, so we're on Shield Base set and the Evolutions Pack. Along with the Galarian Ponyta Art Card. Larian Ponyta. This Pokemon will look into your eyes. There's a little bug on the desk. I'm just gonna squish. It's gone. This Pokemon will look into your eyes and read the contents of your heart. If it finds evil there, it promptly hides away. Isn't that like the whole war between like uh, unicorns and how if you're an unpure heart, they won't show themselves to you or something like that. I feel like I heard of that somewhere. Okay. And that goes all the way over there. There's supposed to be a different card. Different card that we don't have yet. And yeah, maybe we'll get it eventually. Okay. We have the evolution, so let's start out with that. Oh, come on. There we go. A fat Pikachu. The best of Pikachus. Alright, there is the code card on the end. Go one, two, three to the front. Alright, and we are starting off with Brock's Grit. De evolution spray. De evolve one of your evolved Pokemon and put the highest stage evolution card on on it into your hand that's pretty cool i didn't even know that card existed that's uh that's kind of cool was that is that a new card like that they added to the set or was that an original card uh leave a comment down below i honestly have no idea there is ninorino got the reverse earlier we have the beautiful fat pikachu looks like you lost a few pounds in the new anime and cards and such it's a it's a nice throwback Especially with the yellow cheeks. It's a nice throwback. There's Machop. We have Growlithe. Onyx. Ninoran. Ooh, we have the best of floppy fish. Reverse Magikarp. And on the very end, we have a completely useless piece of shit dugong. Great, I'm happy about that. Yeah, yeah, gets a, gets the blood flowing. You feel me, boys? All right, our last pack, the Sword and Shield base set here. Let's see what we can get. Okay. Right, there is the code off the back. Go one, two, three to the front, getting rid of the fire energy. We have Thwacky! Just whacking away, learning to beat his drum like Rillaboom beats his meat. Yeah, two, uh, same joke twice. Eat me. We have the Palpad. We have the Citrus Berry. We have Ferro Seed. And it's a claymation. I really, really like the claymation designs. I like that they brought it back. I like that they're using it again. I, I, I just like it. I think it makes for a good card. Something you don't see all the time. We have Goldeen. We have Roselia. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We have Joltik. We have Silly Cobra. 
we have Battle Toy. And on the very end, we have... Okay! We have a Sableye V. That's really cool. Sableye is one of uh, my favorite Pokemon. I love his shiny. I love the gold. I love how crazy he is and how fast he is. That's a... That's a cool card to get. Okay, so uh, today wasn't completely pointless. We got a we got a couple decent cards. All right, cool. Well, guys, I really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like down below. And if you want to see me do anything else, just leave a comment telling me what you might want to see. If you want to see more, subscribe. I post a new video every two days. And I hope to see you guys next time. See ya.